Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope that you are doing well. So here I am with one of the most important topics, okay, for your first language English exam, okay. So the topic is of pair words, okay. And from this topic and it is mainly from the grammar part, okay. You are going to get four marks directly. Okay, there will be four questions. Each will carry one mark and uh, if you write them properly, correctly, you are going to get the four marks. Okay. So, before moving to explain the types of questions, let me tell you uh, on which topic you are going to expect questions like this. Okay. See, these are the topics where you can expect the questions. So the topics are from parts of speech. Okay, you all know that uh, noun, pronoun, verb, adjective, adverb. Okay, mainly on these five, they are going to ask questions like uh, progress, progressive, victory, victorious. So what is this progress? Progress is a. It is a noun. Okay, progress is a noun, and progressive is yes, it is adjective. So they will give question like victory. Again, this is noun. What will be the adjective form of victory? It is victorious. Understood? So that is how you have to identify whether they have given noun or adjective. And then referring these two, you have to answer the next two question. Similarly, you can also get question based on meaning, synonyms or glossary. Okay. This you have to refer your textbook glossaries. Okay. Most of the time they give the questions from that part itself okay and mainly one word meanings not the one which is a little lengthier so try to read one word meaning from all the chapters of your glossary so here elude what does it mean escape similarly they will give what is this ecstasy it means happiness okay so this one will not be given you have to write got it Next type will be antonyms, okay? Like the sim in simple words, we call it as opposite words, okay? For example, deep, shallow, okay? They are opposite to each other. Similarly, cowardice, it is brave. So you have to learn them also. Next is based on number, okay? Whether it is the given is singular or plural. For example, they make you like radius. The radius, its plural form is radii. Bacterium, it is bacteria. Got it? Next, on the basis of prefix. Moral, here you will see, it is immoral. Real, uh, real, it is unreal. So, these two are what? They are prefix. They will give the, again, using prefix, you can get antonyms as well. So, antonyms based on the meaning of words as well as on the basis of prefix you may get. Next type is one word medical terms okay this is very important dentist teeth okay the doctor of teeth in simple term is uh, he's called as what he or she is called as dentist what about that of a skin doctor we call it as dermatologist so i have made a separate page for that okay uh, you just refer and try to learn them all okay i hope you can see it there are 20 names you can see okay 20 this uh, medical terms one word substitution for medical terms okay so you try to learn all this okay the one who treats eye disease they may just give eye oculist they may give uh, children disease of children you have to write this pediatrics okay so and uh, sorry diseases will be given like diseases of eye diseases of children like that okay and one who treats the doctor that is different okay so try to learn them all you can take a screenshot of this and uh, learn them it's very important for your pair words next type is homophones okay so homophones means they sound similar but their meaning is different. For example, roll, roll. Okay. 
roll number okay both of them are sounding similar but the meaning is different great similarly you have to write again the sound pronunciation should be same but the meaning is different so you can write great and last is rhyming word okay for example gate its rhyming word is late what about wine you can write fine you will get many fine okay then also you can write uh, uh, mine okay then many words you can get fine wine mine okay okay so these are the types on which you can expect the questions from pair words okay so i have given some of the important homophones here okay try to learn them all here you have the questions and here the answers so learn them properly okay they are homophones or homonyms both are same now let us see some of the questions okay which can be asked for your exam actually these are mainly from the uh, previous year questions as well as the model question paper okay so this will be the heading in your exam observe the relationship in the first pair of words and complete the second pair accordingly in the following okay so here again remember this five uh, whatever i have explained how many topics are there one two three four five six seven and around eight topics okay so let us see one by one yeah so the first question is generous generosity victorious victorious yes it is victory got it just by looking at this you can easily write next potent powerful so this is meaning gallant brave it is from your one of your chapter okay next fortune misfortune so it is prefix just unjust got it next cattle herd so what is this the group of cattle are called as herd what about group of sailors they are called as yes you can write crew okay next some some so it is a homophone here you can write here okay here here both of them are correct next success successfully okay next courage this is noun and this is adverb courage sorry adjective uh, sorry sorry it is adverb what about courage it is courageous okay next argue argument laugh it is laughter next symbol symbolize appeal it remains the same okay don't write appealize okay it is appeal itself this is a noun verb appeal again appeal is verb next is elude meaningful they have given elude escape ecstasy it is happiness next roll roll great this one i explained great moral immoral real what is this unreal right progress progressive victory victorious next sustain maintain it is meaning meaning of sustain is maintain what about imbibe so for that you can write grasp okay this is the right answer again it is there in the textbook got it next blue blue again homophones bear what you can write for this yes you can write bear this one we say bhalu right in hindi next qualify disqualify responsible it is irresponsible this is based on prefix responsible irresponsible next strength strong mystery mysterious okay you can write that rain rain root yes root let me write the spelling of this it is mysterious okay next question is radius radii story again 
singular plural so what about story so it is stories okay this one next except except exception accept acceptance okay peril dangers danger whilst again it is meaning you will get this from textbook itself it is risky okay risky next dentist teeth dermatologist yes it is skin next gallant brave stature you can write height okay or even you can write size decide decide decision prefer preference preference is the right answer next is literate illiterate what is this yes it is it is uh, a, if i'm not wrong uh, it is perturbable okay so just add im perturbable what it next meet meet blue blue admit admission discover yes it is discovery got it beautiful beauty simple you can write simplicity next late gate wine fine nose nose check yes check the check book okay next bachelor spinster sculpture it is sculptures next deep shallow okay they are opposite to each other shallow courage it is cowardice next what is this plentiful abundant meaning again from the glossary cascade it is waterfall next slowly adverb what is slowly it is an adverb what about intelligent yes it is adjective it is a quality so it is an adjective next herd cattle hive dash so group of cattle are called as herd group of and dash is called as hive so it is bees okay honey bees next honey bee complete incomplete nutrition malnutrition okay next meat meat blue again it is blue next die die peace so this peace shanti wala peace got it next is ice ophthalmologist what about heart the doctor of heart is called as cardiologist right let us check it here the one heart heart where is it okay i think it's not given yeah it is cardiologist itself okay cardiologist next is whim sudden desire again this is from your textbook reluctant what do you mean by rel reluctant you can write uh, unwilling or hesitate both of them are correct unwilling or hesitate or hesitation next important unimportant regular it is irregular kidney urologist what is children okay the one who treats the problem of kidney is called as urologist about the doctor of children is what is that pediatrician correct yes you can write this pediatrics but the it is the science which deals with disease of children that is pediatrics and the doctor is called as pediatrician okay next is infect infection remember remembrance okay next sheep flocks ships yes it is fleet and the last one angel angelic autumn autumn so it is autumnal it is a u t u m n a l okay so i hope you have understood all this question 
as well as the answer and how to solve them if you get a question so let me give you a homework question try to write the answer of this question in your in the comment section okay don't forget to write it the question is uh, uh, let me write it grateful and they have given ungrateful grateful ungrateful then what will be the answer for agreeable agreeable what will be the answer so try to write it in the comment section i hope you liked it if yes kindly do forward it with your classmate and don't forget to like the video also if you're new to this channel kindly do subscribe it we'll see you all in my next video till then take care bye prepare well and all the best for your exam see you